Hi guys, welcome back. And we are back with Divide and Conquer Door Winning Episode 16, I believe. And things have been going okay. We are getting converged on by Big Gan Alton over here and Captain Lug, who has trolls. Um, so yeah, that's going to be fun. But uh, apart from that, we will be fine. Uh, is everything looking quite decent down here as well? Captain Gus is on the way to Avalyn's Rest. Even with the paved roads, it's very slow moving through Mordor. Low supplies and all that uh, all that jazz. I think you might as well join Captain Gus as well, because Marv is happy enough now. So yeah, uh, Mistrand is now suddenly making a lot more money. Mistrand really can be a hidden gem when you want it to be. I think we're we are getting Thorn Barracks there, but honestly... It's probably a bad decision. Probably shouldn't have done that. <laughs> but we nearly got another army on the way. Yes. We are building the uh, militia garrison here, which is good for us. Uh, and we're building it in Erin Runen, just in case while well, Edwardin is getting retrained uh, at Santamwe, uh, whether we need to uh, defend these places. So, yeah. All good. Right then, let's end the turn. And hopefully, we shall see Mordor attack us here. Because I really do want to defend the city rather than fight both of these armies on the field. Although, maybe individually fighting them both would be a good idea. But getting them both out of the way to start with might be quite nice. Uh, it does look like they are both going to go for Austin Eri, which is quite funny. But, oh no. They've decided to head off together. Oh no, Gan Alton's just come after us. Okay. That's fine. I'm happy to fight you one-on-one, -on -one, Gan Alton. You bloody uh, spirit. What are you? <laughs> you white. You're not even a real human. You are like a ghost. I don't know. Is he, He's like a spirit thing. <laughs> I can't even think of the words right now. But he is a white. He's a white, isn't he? But yeah. Gondor's la leader is dead. The steward, no. I think that is Denethor. I don't believe see, seeing... An, I don't remember seeing another message. Erin Runen's not too happy. They've destroyed the Grog Hut. Um, there's really not much we can do about that. So hopefully they don't... They don't... They, they don't rebel. We've got a lot of things happening with Norway the Unstoppable Mining Advisor. I mean, that's not going to be too helpful for Big Norway, to be honest. Karasant, we got some more... Soldiers, you guys get over there. Karasant, let's get these boys over this way as well. Are we getting anyone at Strondos that we really want? Not really. I don't really want to fight that tiny army because it's pointless. Uh, don't want to accept the guild just yet. Austin area is being besieged, like we said. Viltor's got some nice units in there. Probably worth getting these guys back now, honestly, so they can get that upgrade from the blacksmith when we get in there. These guys apparently don't get the upgrade. What's going on with that? Why can they not get the upgrade? I mean, it, the blacksmith should mean next turn maybe they'll get it. Uh, Edward in. Let's go for Rawberg. Oh, hello. Captain Azrum. Get away. And uh, let's end the turn. Oh, no. We've got to accept that guild. Sorry. We need to build. We need to build. I nearly forgot about building. That's my favorite thing to do in this game. <laughs> Mornathel. Yes, we were building the barracks, weren't we? So, can we get the next level of barrack? Hmm. Huh. Why can we not? Do we need the Great Hall for that, maybe? So let's go for the Great Hall. Uh, Mistrand. We can actually get the Trading Plaza at Mistrand. Let's have a look at what that might do for the settlement. The so trade goes up by 200, basically. Also gets 80 from that. So it's about 280 for a 4,500 cost building. Um, that's not terrible, but I think the Master Mason's Hall is what what we want to do there. Uh, so, Naburka, nothing. Mataram, though. What have we got going on for Mataram? A mining network would be good eventually, but probably not yet. 
go for the chicken farming instead. Get that population growth booming. Because we've got a few more settlements we need to build in, don't we? Burr Alga. Let's go for the... Oh, we could go for the military garrison, which is a lot better. But six turns. Honestly, is it worth it? I don't think so. So let's go for the... I could go with standard Thorn Barracks, just in case. I think that's probably worth it. Avalyn's Rest. True. Let's go for the... I mean, the Armourer here. All these guys can get retrained, in fact. Uh, but yeah, let's stick the... Uh, don't want the Armourer probably yet. Let's go for the Thorn Barracks in there, though. Austin Airy. Let's just get the Grain Exchange. That's fine. We are under siege there anyway, so not going to matter. Uh, but yeah. Little while until we can retrain those boys. Karasant. Yeah, we can actually retrain a ship or two now as well, which is good. No special units available for training just yet. Actually, here we can train those boys, so let's get them in there. And let's end the turn again. Oh no, we can't. Get the guild. We've only got nine gold left this turn. And very soon we'll, we'll be making a lot less money because we'll have this whole army out of the city ready to fight. Um, and this one, where are we going to send this one? I think we go, go straight down the middle, really, with this one. If we can take Rawberg, we'll probably, yeah, we'll probably send it north. We'll leave Norway to the south. Oh, I mean, more of the threat is coming from Mordor, though. But that's why I say middle. Let's do middle. Let's go straight down the middle and see what we can do there. See what we can do. Um, hopefully push through Dolgador pretty easily, honestly. Because Dolgador are not great, are they? <laughs> As we've seen so far. In an open field battle, Dolgador, yeah, not the, not the best. Not the best. Not fantastic, <laughs> I've got to say. Uh, but yeah. They are orcs, and all the orc factions are not very good. <laughs> Apart from Isengard, really. But Mordor, Mordor is good. You just need to recruit the right units. Mission failed, really couldn't care less, honestly. Rioting in Eren Runen again. They're still only on 60%. Really? Oh, please don't flip. Please don't flip. That'll be really annoying. Really annoying. Right, let's get the Thorn Riders over here. You can't even get in. God damn. <laughs> uh, and let's retrain everyone. Get the extra armor. Uh, and that's why we're sending these boys back for the extra armor from the blacksmith. Let's get the armor in there for later on versions. We can get the winery here as well, which is actually a fantastic building. So we should get that at some point. We actually built in a lot of places. I very much doubt we're going to be able to build in many more this turn. I think it's time to get the Master Mason's Guild House or whatever it's called in there. And that's about as much as we can do this turn. Uh, how are we looking over here? I do really want those reinforcements. So let's keep coming down this way. And uh, yeah, I think we're looking good. Lest, Mistrand, Elgaia, Rubar, Winterian Yar, Naberka, Strondost. Uh, what else have we got? We've got Edward in. Hopefully there's no one in Rawberg. Hopefully there's no one there. Doesn't look like there's many people, so that's good. That's really good. And what else have we got? Uh, yeah, you guys are moving. Austin Airy. Hopefully this army's built... Oh, they've built a lot of rams. <laughs> oh, got to accept the guild house. Let's end the turn anyway, and let's see what happens. It's looking good. We are, we're doing pretty well, I've got to say. You know, we're not doing badly. Not doing badly at all. Um... It's just like really little annoying things like Mordor just sending three stacks through to take stuff. And like Dolgador just taking Rawberg as soon as we've taken it just for no reason when we're attacking, you know, further into their land. 
But the AI is dumb, so I can't really blame them. Ah, Gan Alton, my friend. Gan Alton. Oh my god, it's actually a decent-ish army. Decent enough. We're going to struggle here, especially because it's so... Austin Aries, just a terrible settlement to defend. Like, awful. Until it becomes a bigger settlement, it's not going to be a good settlement to defend. But anyway, I think we'll be okay. So I will see you all there, guys. I'll see you all there. I wonder what his... Uh, let's just check. Oh, he's got just Temple Wards, which are a great unit, but we'll just have to try and take them out. So I will see you there, guys. Hi, guys. Right. Let's have a look at what we have here. I mean, they've got eight rams. But they're all just lined up. They've only got... They're only going for the one ram attack at the minute. Which, honestly, is, is pretty dumb of them. But I'm happy to oblige. If they only want one hole, then that is fine. In terms of our archers, I think our best ones, like Norway, should go up here. Maybe even these guys slightly in front of them. Even maybe, like, here if they can go there. Um... I mean, the Vari Naharim can fire as well. So you guys can go here, maybe. I think the Vari Naharim can actually go out of the settlement. I mean, yeah, it doesn't look like the game wants to put them anywhere. So that's fine. These guys can go here if they'll fit. Oh, the pathing, man. Come on. Same with these boys. Uh, who else have we got? I think that's everyone in terms of the bowmen. So let's group them together uh, in terms of the infantry and the cavalry let's get the cavalry first so cavalry 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 you guys can all be grouped together we'll stick you all down here ungroup you for now it's terrible 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 pathing come on oh god damn sometimes sometimes right if they only go for the one attack that's great for us. We we'll literally just have the Men of the Thorn all defending in here. So we'll group you together. We'll have these guys in here as well because they're rubbish. Same with you. You're not rubbish, but yeah. You need to be in there. And these guys in here to fire their javies over the heads of the men. There we are. Uh, so yeah, you need to be grouped together. And then the rest of these boys. Let's get you in here for now. Uh, you boys can hold back, but I'm thinking if we do an extra, like, shield wall in here as well, that'll be extra effective. Men of the Thorn. So, like, <laughs> this is just, like, the mass and then we can get our Aminyar, like, swordsman to the side. And the elven boys on this side. If they'll fit. There we are. Well, let's see what happens anyway. Well, that was a great shot, wasn't it, to start the battle? But okay. Right, Cav. Let's get you out. There you are. Get out of the city. Same with the Avari Naharim. Get there. These guys should all be firing very soon. They just want to bring everyone through the main center. Through the main gate. Honestly, quite happy with that. These guys have by far the best firing position. This is why this is not a good defensible map, guys. Is because your archers really, really struggle to get any good fire in there. As you can see, one guy firing. Wait, let's see. They're all going to... Like, a lot of them will have to fire up. Okay, they are firing pretty flat, which is quite good. I'm actually impressed by that. But yeah, they've got decent units for orcs. Ran and guard aren't too bad. But the temple wards, they really are. They're the main issue here. Uh, let's get you guys there. I mean, you guys don't really need to get in too far. But yeah, this should be a pretty hard block of men to get through, to be honest. So, uh, actually, you guys don't fire just yet. We'll wait for you guys to fire. Right, Avari Naharim. Let's wait until they've broken down the gate, and then that's when we'll go in with our guys trying to harass the temple wards. So let's uh, speed it up slightly. 
Oh, they lost the men on the gate. Because so I don't know what they're going to do now. Yeah, they actually just... They just lost too many men on the gate. These black orcs are getting shredded now as well. I mean, if they can't break down the gate, it's not my problem. I'm not going to try and scum them like I have done so many times before. Well, what are they doing? Oh, they're bringing a new ram. But well, where is that ram going to go? Will it go through the other ram? Well, that's Temple Wars. That's their general. Fire at that. Everyone fire at that. That is what we need to kill. If their general goes in first, they're going to try and push through the other ram. Well, that is a seriously good battering ram. It pushes through other rams. <laughs> well, we managed to get kill quite a few of the Temple Wards, and they are the best unit that they have access to right now by far. And also, look at this. They're having to push past the ram. Guys, what the fuck are you doing? You're in a shield wall, you idiots! Jesus fucking Christ, man. You're in a shield wall! Don't push forward. You are incredibly stupid. Incredibly stupid. Like, not just stupid. Like, incredibly, incredibly stupid. Like, you have just wasted your whole unit by doing that. You imbeciles. So they have about a thousand men in that small area right now. So let's get our uh, cav here because they should actually be able to get a decent-ish charge off on the back of there. Look how thick together those guys are. You should also be able to get some very nice shots in here. So here they come. Breaking through this block is going to be a big challenge for them though. But just the temple wards, that's the main issue. That's the main people we have to contend with. You guys get there. You guys charge in. Right now, you guys can uh, start firing your jabbies. Should be uh, pretty easy for you to fire into there. Right, Cav. This is your time to shine, guys. If you mess this up, I'm going to be... What is wrong with this, this thing? Go there. Come on. This should be one of the best charges that you'll ever do in your life, Cav. You should be happy about this charge. Why are the halberds coming out? Like, that's just dumb. I mean, it means my cavalry's not got halberds to face, so I guess that's okay. <laughs> but yeah, this is, this is just brutal. Crossbowmen get firing. These guys should get some good... Why are you firing up? Fire flat, for God's sake. Why are the halberds doing this? God damn. Just so dumb, honestly. Just fuck off. Piss me off sometimes. Right, come on. Kill them. These Javis should be nice. Where? I wonder where their general is. It's hard to find them in here. Temple Wards there. Temple Wards. 54 now. 54. I mean, honestly... I'm not averse to charging these guys. Who are you? So you're the rope. No, no, no. So you just go there, and the us three will charge them in the back. Wait, was someone upset then? No, you should all be happy. I mean, taking away the black auric halberds from inside there is not really too bad a too bad a thing to do. I think we might be able to break these guys if they're. They're facing the other... Oh my god, what is your pathing doing? You're charging the wrong fucking way. Guys, what are you doing? They're here! They're there! You are honestly so dumb. Oh my god, I am salty today. This is just pissing me off. Like, why, are they, why is it so stupid? Fucking charge them, Jesus Christ. That wasn't even a charge. Wasn't a charge. You idiots. Oh my god, man. Oh. Why sometimes, man? I love this game to bits, but... I think it's just because of like how old it is. It just pisses you off like by how shit everything is on it now. Like compared to the modern games or the remastered. Like, just everything on it is just hard work. Compared to the new ones. 
See, is that even a charge? You've hardly killed anyone, you fucking idiots. Well, why aren't you firing? Jesus Christ. You're on fire at will, aren't you? Oh, God. Honestly. Honestly. Right, you guys get in there. If you guys fired off your jabbies, I think we just need to kill the general, and then we'll be okay. So a few jabbies going in there. Let's kill them. Like, this time, can you actually charge them? Or are you just going to fuck around? Like, please charge them properly. Like, that's not a charge! That's a jog! You're not going to charge either, are you? Oh my god. Like, why aren't you charging? You imbeciles, honestly. Right, well, fuck these guys. Like, let's not worry about them. They're just pissing me off too much. Vari Naharim, just get away a bit. Why won't you still fire when you're running? Come on. Right, now we should be able to go for a nice... Okay, they've, they've broken through enough now that they're kind of spread in the middle here. Hoping that this will, like, make them scared. Just can't be asked to deal with you. Uh, don't want to get crushed by their, like, stuck by their guys, though. That's the one thing. Come on, guys. Where is... Where is this guy? Oh, I wonder where... Temple Wards. There's one. Unless that's a captain. It could be a captain of another... Of another thing. There's a Temple Ward. Maybe. Here's a Temple Ward. 37 still. Wow. They are doing very well. These guys, come on, keep firing. We'll get the Moriquendi Sentinels here ready to charge in just in case. And uh, cavalry, let's get out. Navari Naharim, how, like, keep firing, man. Only half the enemy force remains. How many have we lost? About the same. <laughs> Stop firing up, just fire in. <laughs> Same with you guys. Don't fire up. Just fire in. Yeah, just fire directly in there. Like killing fields right now, aren't they? Get over there. You guys go and fire at them. God, these halberds are just, just so unbelievably annoying right now. <laughs> I didn't realize it gets so annoyed by them, but yeah. Right, the temple wars. They just need to go. Where is Gan Alton? We should be able to see him. A few arrows hitting the uh, temple wards there, which will definitely help. But we should be able to see Gan Alton in a cloak. That guy's just charging. Go on, man. I don't see any man in any uh, cloaked Nazgul right now. Yep, don't see any cloaked Nazgul. Uh, I'm hoping he'll be in the front line, like around here. Can you see him anywhere? Is that him there? I think that's him. He will have... Oh, there he is. Yep. You guys. No, not them. Temple Guard. Temple Ward. The fucking Temple Ward. Come on. Let me hover over the temple ward. There we are. I think you guys should get, like, close and then be able to fire directly in. I oh, know. You guys got to charge in now. Okay. These guys aren't getting attacked by anyone. Right. We've, we've, we've run out of options here. Let's go fight them. I think we should, like, if we could just charge through these guys now, that would be good. Actually, if they could actually charge, that would be nice. It's going to get very, very, very desperate soon. Now, where's Gan Alton now? Please don't tell me he's, like, in the middle now. There he is. He's fighting. Yes. He's fighting on the front line. He will have a lot of hit points, though. Hoping we killed them. 
No, we didn't. Oh, god damn. One of the most annoying units I've ever seen in my life. Oh, this battle is just, just really annoying. Speed up. Right, now we'll go for the charge on this side. Hopefully they don't turn around. That should really kill them. So this should kill them. Come on, boys. Don't know why that Moranian guard's running out of the city. They're not even going to rout. I suppose because Gan Alton. So once he's dead, I think they should all rout, basically. But let's uh, let's get ready for that anyway. Let's get over there. Long battle. Long defense. What are these guys doing? <sighs> Just piss off. Right. Uh, Gan Alton. He's there. I think we've got to go in with Norway now. Well, where, where's he gone now? Where's he gone? Because we've got to find the place to charge in, so that we can actually kill him. If we continue like this, I mean, charge in, but I've got to find him. Where is he? He's disappeared now. That's not a good sign. That is no orc horn. Let's get that done. Where is he? Genuinely, where is he? Where's he disappeared to now? He was literally just there. Is he on the front line? He might be on the front line. The elves. Oh, there he is. There he is. Let's get him. Come on, guys. Oh, God damn. God damn it. Oh, look how many bloody cavalry have just died because of that. Because those guys just decided to be a bloody nuisance. Come on. And we still got these guys in the center in case. So let's come forward. Looks like they're going after these guys. So hopefully Gan Alton will come forward. Where is he now? Keep losing him. He just seems to be slipping further and further away from the front line. It's really hard to see him. But whatever, as long as he dies, that's all that matters. Come on. Where are you, big Gan? Gan the man. Well, Gan the not, not man, I guess. Gan the non-man. Right, let's give them a charge. See, see how they like it. You want Sham? I'll give it ya. Yeah, do they see him? I don't see him at all. Come on, Norway. This is your battle to win, my friend. Did we actually get a charge? Yeah, they're, they're really just not wanting to rout right now because Ganalton must be so good in uh, command. So it's just all about killing him. If we'd have managed to kill him like early on, we would have... Won this battle. Ah, oh, there he is. Come on. Yes. Come on, the elves. Let's go break through. Kill those temple wards. I know they're very good, but so are we. Don't slip back. Don't let him slip back. Where's he disappeared to now? I swear he keeps disappearing. He was literally just there. There he is. Come on. Kill him. He's just appeared again. Yes. Stab him. He's got to die. He's getting hit. Come on. How many times does it take? Maybe we need Eowyn. Come on. Come on. This is it. Look how many dead. Oh, my days. Thousands dead in the gateway. All good men defending the gate. This army is all but ruined now. All but ruined. I don't think we could have taken on both of those armies, honestly. Especially with Gan Alton leading this one. Those temple wards are ridiculously strong. Six left. Let's use it again. What does this even do? Plus 150% own army combat effectiveness. Plus five own troops morale. 
plus three allied troops morale. So my troops shouldn't route, basically. And they're going to be a bit more effective. But there he is. He's getting bullied. Kill him. Come on. Yes! That should be it. That should be it. Let's go. Surely they're not going to be happy now. Yes. Let's go. They're shaking already. Gan Alton's gone. Gan Alton's gone. Take that, you stinking orcs. Honestly, piss me off through this whole video. So, I'm glad that your leader is dead. <laughs> Come on. Just got to break him. Let's go. Let's get in there. Let's get through the gate. Yes. 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 Single one Moran and Guard still fighting on. What a brave orc. Oh, we killed 95% of them as well. I mean, we've still got 1,300. How many did... We must have healed quite a lot then. Yeah, 157 bladesmen. Yeah, we healed a lot of men from that. But, oh, wow. Mori Quinty Sentinels, 300. Crossbowmen, 260. Fair play. First time the cross... Crossbowmen really do do well in sieges. But that's about it. Yvari Naharim as well. Yvari Shadows. Uh, no one... Serves. The Avari Spearman, actually, 223. Fair play. Well, I will see you back on the campaign map, guys. Here we are, guys, and let's execute them after that. Salty, salty, salty battle. Oh. Oh. Well, that, that's one big army just fully ruined, which is good. So hopefully this army with trolls might be... <laughs> Not easy. But might be, yeah, okay, okay. We'll have a look at that army after this turn anyway and see what it's saying. A merchant's guild in Erin er Runin. Now, I'll accept that. 17,000. All thanks under siege as well. The Wood Elves flourish. Good. Uh, right. Oh, my God. I mean, I think it's time, guys. I think we just abandon Erin Runin. Let the uh, let the elves have it, and we'll take as much money as we can from it. I mean, I'll leave the uh, the standing stones in there because uh, we just built that uh, merchant's guild as well. Yep, let's leave. Stick it on very high for for now. Uh, hopefully, this. If they riot to... Oh, it's, it's all Melkor Shadow. I was going to say, if they riot to the Elves, then it'll put us at war with the Elves. But if it's all Melkor Shadow, it shouldn't do right. I mean, it shouldn't, thematically, anyway. But it just really shouldn't. Oh, hello, Captain Nazdug. Nazdug the Slug. We shall come and fight you, my friend. Well, Strondost, let's see. What else can we build here? I think we've built... As much as we can, really, for a wooden castle. So let's build the port. Lest as well. Let's build that ship right in there. Winterian Yar. Let's go for the herbalist. Mataram. We got the chicken farming. I think. Yeah, Mataram. Probably the the, the paved roads are not really that useful. Because no one's actually moving through here. It make it make them more money, I guess. But okay, let's go sheep farming instead. Um, yeah, that's fine. More faction announcements. No way. Savior of cities plus three command plus one troop morale. Nice. He is a savior after all. Very good. Uh, what else have we got? Uh, enemy army routes. No way. The unstoppable. What a name. What a man. Uh, or elf, should I say. What an elf. <laughs> right. So, let's get everyone in here. Let's make sure we're retraining. Let's get you guys in as well. And then we've got the four in there. So, that means one more unit we need. A single unit. A singular unit. Uh, what could we go for? Oh, we're actually training more elves. So, <laughs> that'll be it then. <laughs> Uh, yeah, good, 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 good. Oh, wait, Moriquindy Protectors? Did I just send the... I just sent the Sentinels. God damn it. I didn't mean to do that. Ah, uh, oh well. 
Well, we will do all those battles next turn. But let's uh, let's build where we can. Enmahath. I mean, it would be nice to get that in there. But let's get the chicken farming. Elgair. Let's go for something in terms of the population growth, probably. That'll be good. Rhubar. Rhubar really needs to upgrade. It's not too far from upgrading now, though. So the Apothecary would probably help. That's everywhere. Fantastic. That is glorious. Building everywhere again. And we still got 6,000 in the bank. Next turn, though... We are definitely not going to make that much money. Although it says 19,000. So that's quite good. But anyway, guys, we will do this battle and t try and, you know, scourge the land around Avalyn's rest of these filthy orcs next turn. And we shall also... Uh, where was the other battle? We should also fight for Rawberg as well. But thank you very much for watching, guys. It's been a pleasure as always. Please do like and subscribe, all that good stuff. It really does help the channel out. And I will see you all again on the next video.